<laughs> All right, so we're talking today about um, businesses can't register in Trinidad and Tobago because our silver is down. How cool is that? No new companies registered following system crash last year. No new companies have been able to register to legally conduct business in this country since last year. That's because the company's registry systems aid servers crashed since December 9th and have not been up and running since then. What is the first thing that jumps out to you here, boy? I so, I mean, if you're running like an enterprise system, which, which I assume this is, you know, you're supposed to have like a maintenance schedule and a schedule where you monitor not only your hardware but your software to make sure you're, you're, you're within the support support period. Your, your hardware not too old because something, you know, if you're beyond five years, beyond six years, you need to refresh, you know, to mitigate risk of hardware failure. And you, you uh, could attest, you, you could yeah, attest but, to that, you know, being yeah, having froze, but, your computer froze. <laughs> Yeah, you know, you, you probably need to monitor your stuff, make sure your driver's, sure up the driver's to date. updated. Uh, that yeah. is true. But you're talking about it like you in a private company. And I I saying that I know people working in the government and I know some of them running a Dell Blade 2860 or something so on on the um on a rack right now that yeah. have no cooling. The f- one of the fans now working and yeah, well, Alaska use, fan pointing at it all. And it using <laughs> tape drives to back it up. I know when they say eight servers, and the first thing that jumped to my head is AS four hundred, right? Uh, uh, AS four hundred servers like what them um big insurance companies, something you see used back in the late nineties. But there was a time when they stopped servicing them. They they stopped um, supporting them basically. And you had to take on the support for yourself by the pass and all that kind of stuff. And private companies was like, no, this thing too hard to maintain. And essentially what you just go and do is buy a, a Dell Silver up a Xeon processor inside of it. And you copy the tables, the SQL tables, and the same SQL Silver running on it now. I don't know. I am not surprised, but I'm also this real sad. Because registering a business is something that the government pushing people to do. Be an entrepreneur. Be technological. Do things and you know you had to find your way because you can't depend on the government to make to do everything for you and all that kind of talk and since the 9th of december you can register a business